All right, here we are. We just finished our zero in Franklin and we're heading off into the woods at Winding Stair Gap. It's uh, the 2nd of April. Chilly morning, but we're glad to get back on trail. It was nice at uh, Sunset and Chica's, but uh, it's good to get back on the trail. As you can see, my wrangly beard got trimmed. Not bad, found a barber and away we went. All right, we'll see you up the trail. Here we are at the top of Silo Mountain, just outside of Franklin. It's our first, sorry, Silo Bald, is what it's called. This is our first, uh, first hill. A quarter of a mile off the main AT on the Blue Blaze. And Susan's slowly making her way up. I want to pass it by, but she wants to come see it. So up we are. Just to give you a view of where we are. It's basically 360 degrees right on the top of a vault. How do you like that climb, Susan? No joke, it's hot. <laughs> it's a long way down there. All right, here comes Susan. We're at Way of Bald. I'm in the current, the tower currently. And she's just coming up. She was taking pictures of the sign. Well, this is the view from Way of Bald. It's not a forestry tower. It's just an observation tower. And you can see the town in the distance. My legs are tired. Down the distance this way is the Great Smoky Mountains, which we're going to be hitting in the next four days or so and then heading back towards Franklin and back to the trail along. What do you think Susan? It's Pretty good climb. It's beautiful here. And what did we get at the top of the hill? Somebody had a beer for us. Trail magic. I'm like what? And his name was Double Back. Double Back. <laughs> I keep wanting to call him Redo, but Double Back. His name is Double Back. He hiked the trail a few years ago. And he's just up there doing, doing some magic. Yeah, it's amazing. He's here at the top. I'm like, what? Are you crazy? Good morning. It's about 9 o'clock on the 3rd of April. And we just pulled out of uh, Way of Bald Shelter, heading out. Beautiful day. You can see the sun. I took a picture of the sunrise this morning. It's actually quite nice. What do you think, Susan? Did you have a good sleep? I had a great sleep. I went to bed about 6.30 and got up at 6. <laughs> <laughs> it's cold, though, but, it was, you know, not too bad. It was a chilly night again. I think it got down to about 34 last night. Oh, it was a chilly morning. But that's good. We warm up quickly. Bye. Bye. Hi. It's April 3rd and we just came up from the last shelter. I think it was Crystal Lake or something. But this is Rocky. Cold Spring. Cold Spring. Thank you. And this is Rocky Ball, the approach. And uh, this is a beautiful view that we kind of happened upon. And I guess if you could, if you want to zoom in, you could see Franklin. Um, it seems like we're going around it. <laughs> but um, it's a beautiful day and uh, a bit chilly, but it's great. So this is the view from Wester Bald, Fire Tower, north of the Smokies, all the way around. And then back down south to Georgia, where we came from. <laughs> hey, I'm not the only one up here. There's lots of people made up here today. Such a beautiful view, an amazing day and great weather. North Carolina is a pretty wow. special state.
What do you think, Susan? Oh, we're hitting the knot. We're walking down to the Nantahala okay. Outdoor Center. Yeah. I'll spin the video around a little bit once we get out of the woods. We just pulled out of our camp spot. It's only about a half a mile back. Yeah. But there's supposed to be a really good breakfast at the restaurant here, so we're looking forward to that. Susan's going to get three cream in her coffee. That's right. that? <laughs> three that? cream. All right. See you at the knock. And here we are at the road. See the big AT signs. Susan taking pictures of every sign she sees. And this is the knock, the Nantahala Outdoor Center. And I'll cross the road here because it looks like it could be a little sketchy at times. And most of the stuff here, it's an entertainment center, so it has white water rafting, zip lines, all that stuff. The Nantahala Outdoor Center. See if we can find the restaurant. There's the general store. It's like a little village in here. All right. All right, here we go. We're just pulling out a sassafras. Uh, I don't know, April 4th or 5th or something. April something or other. There's the shelter down there. And we're just starting up Chio Bald. we do the best we can to get up here and down the other side. And I, I stopped us a few hours early yesterday because I was exhausted. All I could do was kind of talk to the way down. Yeah, it was a 2,000 foot climb and six miles. Yeah. <laughs> so it was pretty high. Anyway. <laughs> well, we'll get there. Next stop is, um, we're not sure. <laughs> Eventually, we're going to get to Fontana Dam where we sent a resupply box. Yeah. Anyway, see ya. Bye. Morning. Good morning. We just left Cable Gap. Shelter. Suppose. What time is it? I have no idea. Hold on. It's somewhere around 8.30, 9 o'clock. And uh, we're five miles from Fontana. 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock. And it was raining yesterday, so we didn't video a lot. It poured. We didn't get any pictures or anything from 11 o'clock until we got here at 5:30. It was just downpour the whole we time. We didn't even take a picture of Bob's phone because he wouldn't recognize his finger because it was too wet. It was too wet. It wouldn't. Yeah, wouldn't so do anything. We got in, we stopped for a bit, and got in around 5. And all I can tell you is that I had a protein bar for supper, and I got my warm mittens on and my clothes, and I was down. She never left the tent once we got it up. It was so toasty. But anyway, onward and upward. Fontana Lodge for tonight. Yeah. Bye. All right. We are now at Fontana. That's the marina down there. This is the parking area. We're just waiting for a shuttle to come pick us up and take us to the village. A couple guys coming down from the trail. We're at the same cable gap. Got a nice washroom here. It's only a five, five and a half mile walk, but hey, it was pretty good. So it's Thursday morning, 7th of April. These are the Great Smoky Mountains. We gotta start hiking over them today. Get to the other side. Fontana Village Resort. Still a little early in the season, so a lot of stuff is still closed here. Um, but wow, I'm sure it's a, an amazing place in the summertime. There's all kinds of different places all over. But those are the mountains we're going to be climbing. The start of the Smokies. So we got eight days after today in the Smokies. This is called the Fontana Hill. It's a hiker lodge, or I should say a hiker shelter, similar to all the other shelters, 
except it's got a little bit more. It's got hot showers, it's got electrical outlets, picnic tables. It's got all kinds of bunks into like monkey area inside. This is a shelter just before we get into the Smokies. It's called the Fontana Hilton. That's the Smoky, the Great Smoky Mountain National Park over there. This is Fontana Lake, created by the dam. And we're just about to go into the Smokies. We're just coming up to the Fontana Dam. There's Susan. She wants to walk on the high water side. So you can see the water's on that side. This is the dam here. here <laughs> all right now I've done the approach and there's the river down below and there's a water side lots of boating happening out there There's a lot of permits in here. Holy crap. You're on. Alright, permit into the box. Yay! Into the box. Your hikers deposit permits okay. here. Now. AT through hikers deposit permits here. Alright, we are registered to go through the smokies. <laughs> 